So we got the 2007 Dodge Grand Caravan here today. Okay, so we're in the 2007 Dodge Grand Caravan. We need to replace the transmission control cylinder. In. So what you need to do is replace this with its proper gasket. If you see its location, it's kind of down there, right underneath the training lines. It's identified by the big connector right here, and three bolts hold it on. I have a brake cleaner and compressed air. So make sure you don't have any dirt and debris fall into the transmission. So we remove our negative battery kit here. The next step is we use the 8mm socket to remove the cable connector to the solenoid. Okay, so here is where things get a little different. What I have done is removed one of the one of the transmission cooler lines and then the sensor that goes into the top to access that bolt. A little bit of training fluid is going to come out. No big deal. Just make sure the area is clean. So we're going to remove those the rest of the way out. So now they've removed the bolts. They're about yay long compared to the trouble light. You can see them. Pretty long. <coughs> if you remove the harness connector so it is free, so now you just get a budget free. So that you see, you pull it out through the bottom, scrape the gasket free, and replace it with a new one. So now you see we got the area all cleaned up, ready to go back in. Alright, so we're now going to put the new part in with its new gasket. I guess it kind of crimps into place. We're just going to put it back up in. Alright, here's a shot from underneath the car. I'm going to try to get this piece up in there. Push up on the harness and slide this piece into place. Just like that. So we're going to take our large little bolts, put them into place, okay make sure you torque the bolts 205 inch pounds, put the sensor back in, okay so we just need to finish putting our lines back in, our connectors are all on, bottle is resecured. Didn't need, even need to take that off. Okay, so now everything's back together. Got our tools all the way. Start her up. Check the training level. See how she drives.